17th question in Nahu Ma Ta'arifu Al-Fi'l. So we talked about nouns and the different types of nouns, Mu'rab, Mabni, and the different types of Mabni. And in, even in Mu'rab, we saw Munsarif, Ghayr Munsarif. So the 17th question, we're beginning verbs. Ma Ta'arifu Al-Fi'li. So the 17th question is simple. What is the definition of a verb? Al-Fi'lu Ma Dalla Ala Hadathin Mukhtarinin Bizamanin. Nahu Kataba Yaktubu Aktubu Uktub it should be Uktub. This Hamza is if this is Amr, this should be Uktub. So Al Fail. So a verb ma dalla ala hadath. It indicates an event, an action, uh, or something which has happened. And it is fixed, or attached. Mukhtarinin Mukhtarin attach ikhtarana yakhtarin is to be attached with. Tense with zaman with some tense. Nahu kataba he wrote, yaktubu he writes, and uktub is write. So there are uh, meanings with no tense plus no tense. You get uh, nouns. There are meanings in it. And nouns like names and mm, there's no time element in it. But if you have a meaning or a hadath which is uh, with tense is equal to verb and then no meaning and then no plus no tense no specific meaning is equal to half or particle so the three parts of speech in Arabic right is fail and half so a meaning plus no tense is nouns meaning plus tense is a verb and there's no meaning specific meaning like min you might think okay min means uh, from but the meaning could change of or sometimes min will be akal to min samaki, yani baad as samak. I ate some of the fish, so that so the contextually the particle meanings change. Hmm? So it has no specific meaning in an, in itself, and then there's no tense also in half, so it is a particle. So ism fail and half. Hmm? So we're talking about fail. Al failu ma dalla ala hadathin muqtarinin bi zamanin. It should be attached with uh, tense. Nahu kataba yaktubu uktub. Inshallah, Ta'ala. Jazakallah khairan, Salaam alaikum.